All right, so we are in the finals with a mirror match. And CS, I think, is pretty much exactly the same. Let me just double check. But and CSU, Arcbound, he has three overseers. Oh, he main decks Thorn. Okay, that's pretty good, actually. I didn't even see that. I will keep. Uh, he leads off with an overseer. Near the Mox Opal. So let's see, I could Genesis Chamber into a Ravenger. I could Genesis Chamber into an overseer. I was afraid. Let's see, he most likely, if he had it in his hand, would have dropped his Memnites. Oh, he could not have dropped a signal pass. Hmm. You know what? I think my best bet is also is to drop an Overseer and kill the tomb. I just have to hope he didn't, you know, I'm sort of hoping he didn't have, he took a chance with lands, maybe. Wow, he did. Wow. Genesis Chamber. So he did get a land. Probably gonna have to eat this chamber. I really, really, really I don't have any other lands in my hand. And I don't want him to get creatures with auto yields. Let's see, so he might have a Revoker, which if he were, has a Revoker, he probably names Ravenger, I think. Oh no, he has a Ravenger. All right, I'm going to eat this. just do not want him to get... Hmm, he has a Clamp, so that's no good. Need a revoker right about now as well. Single past.
Oops, I forgot. I just played that. Let's see. If I do this, he will do nothing. If I do this, yeah, that's fine. So he's at nine life. He uses this, he's at seven. He's got to be a little careful, I think. Because he cannot block the pass. So one, two, three, four, five. I have five, six damage. Actually, I might. Oh. Darn it. So the question here is what do I do? Well, I definitely get the mana crypt. That's five. So he's at seven. So five, six, seven. I put it all here and then he can't block it. Is that right? I think so. Five, six. Maybe I save this. Six. Maybe that's seven. Yeah. All right. I guess. Ooh, if he tangle wires, he's gonna need a lot of land to tangle wire. Abandon hope. <laughs> That's funny. pretty good. So now, what is my ant? I don't think I have an answer. Or I don't have an answer to some planet, but I don't think I have a sideboard. Maybe I'll prefer Metamorph over Genesis Chamber and Dismember over Genesis Chamber. Yeah, that makes sense. Genesis Chamber is just so bad versus in this matchup, so... Thorn really does nothing. Let me just see what he has. Nothing, nothing, nothing. He'll probably bring those in. He'll probably bring those in. Ooh, he'll bring these two in. That's a pretty nice attack. Well, let's see what we got. Hmm. A lot of LD. I'll keep it. Although, a little hesitant. Kill this, but it doesn't do me much. I can play this, that seems better. Hmm. No. <clears throat> okay. 
Well, he's going to get a good beating in here. I think my only real hope at this point drop this memory jar and hope to go off next turn. This is not looking good in the least. If he revokers my memory jars, definitely could be. Oh man. <laughs> Very nice, very nice. Ouch. Alright. I guess it's going to be up to game three. Seed. And let's go on to the next one. Am I only going to make any changes? Submit. And it's all up to this. Game three for the marbles. hand he, or that last game, he just had the perfect hand. Not much I could do. Alright. Well, I think I'll keep this. don't think I'm going to play my Revoker. Here's why. I want to see what he does. What he sort of get lands first. I will play my Archvale Ravager. If he drops a skull clamp, then I'll play it on skull clamp. If he drops Does he have no lands? No. <laughs> He's got the best land there is. Hopefully no skull clamp here. Mana vault. Skull clamp. Ouch. Definitely gonna have to need a skull clamp here. Name Revoker, I mean Ravager. Sure. Question is, does he use? No, he doesn't. All right. So I don't think he's going to block these. I think I'm going to attack first.
question. You know, I have to kill this Talarian. I mean, I could Tangle Wire. It would just be one, two, three. No. I'll Tangle Wire next turn. Okay, so he has a Ravenger as well. So we're going to attack with all again. I don't think he's going to block. Or maybe he will block this. That's fine though. I'm alright with that. I probably should not have attacked. Yeah, I probably should not have attacked with Arcbound Ravenger. Uh, I think that was a mistake. That was a big mistake. Right. I think it was. I don't know. Huh. That's sort of funny. I'm surprised he did that. Oh, interesting. He's playing with... Wow, he's playing with real fire. Surprised he played this crit. One, two, three. Taking one from Mana Vault. Right. 
three. What's he got? No bad one. Okay. He takes two more damage. Sheesh, I don't get that. Down to four. And then on his turn, five. I mean, three. And then if he loses one flip, he's going to have to win a bunch of flips. Is he going to copy? <laughs> he abandoned hope again. That's actually kind of funny. One, two. Not playing that, that's for sure. So let's see, if I attack with all, can't, can't lose this guy. If I attack with these two, can't do that really either. Attack with just this guy, he blocks there. Let me just see. If I attack with all, he lets this see his one. I don't think that does me any good. I'm just going to wait. Well, I guess he can pay four to untap if he wants. Oh, he needs to. <laughs> He needs to do that or he's he loses. He's lost anyway unless he plays a creature. Wow. Alright, well it looks like I pulled this one off. He's giving me the good games. And I win the final, pretty much classic event we're going to have. Eh, got pretty lucky, though. I, uh, I'm not going to say it was all skill. Good games, NCSU.